you haven't cast your vote yet, you still have a little less than two hours to do so. And the people running those polling places are what the Election Commission calls the lifeblood of this process. Of the hundreds working today, we are shining a light on someone who's been doing this for more than two decades. Pen 11 Now's Madison Pitch has the story. This is a squad that keeps democracy running, at least in Precinct 5C1. At the helm, Martha Ellen Florence. I saw the little card that said poll worker, and I thought, oh, this might be interesting, so that's what I did. And then I've been doing it for 20 plus years now. She's risen up the ranks to poll inspector, meaning she oversees the entire election in that precinct, making sure everybody knows what their job is and that every question a voter might have has an answer. General is a lot better than the primaries. I think this particular one's going to be really, really, really busy. Election day can be long for poll workers. Unloading voting booths and machines starts at 7 to be ready for voters at 8 a.m. Polls are open until 8 tonight. Of course, we have to bring treats, so I have to go to the store and get some treats because I don't cook. Longtime volunteers like Martha Allen are a wealth of knowledge for the Lancaster <laughs> County Election for Commissioner's for Office. I mean, without poll workers, our democracy would be uh, put in a difficult spot. There are more than 900 people volunteering at the polls today, and they are all paid for their work. But Martha Allen says the real value comes from serving the community of Precinct 5C1. If you believe in your community, you like you believe in Lincoln, Lancaster County, and Nebraska, if you want to be a servant leader and give back to your community, that's the best way to do, and, and poll working is cool. There is a push to get younger people involved with becoming poll workers. We've got more on registering to do that on our website, 1011now.com. There's also still time to vote. You can find your polling place by checking out our 1011 voter guide on the website as well.